Now Hollis isn't really a poet or a trustworthy person. He's not the only one. Uh, seriously? Well, so much for giving up. I cannot believe you guys. We agreed we'd all stop looking. And yet, here we all are. Did you two really bring your gear? <sighs> Wasn't sure what the train would be like. Wanted to be ready. <laughs> hey, they brought their med kits. This treasure run has been nothing but medical rescues and injuries. I was not about to be one of them. So what tipped it off for you guys? Hollis's yet-to-be-released novel. Gutted in Glendale, and then the part in the poem about a narrow place. Put it together. Glendale Narrows. That was the river for us, said. Taylor said Hollis used to jog here. My wife wrote an algorithm that detects changes in satellite images. OK, well, what do we do now? Six of us, one treasure. Technically, Bobby and I pulled up first. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> because you elected to keep the name of Hollis's unpublished novel to yourself. I didn't know it was important. Also pretty sure this is the first time any of us are hearing about an algorithm. OK, guys, look. It's $5 million, so we split it five ways. Seven. We have a pre-existing deal with Taylor and <laughs> cameraman. The cameraman with no name gets a cut. Oh, I really don't think no, that no, no. anyone who isn't physically here should get a cut. Uh, she, she already knew where we were going. <laughs> okay, fine. Look, we, we, we split it seven ways. I don't know the exact math, but that's enough. Uh, it's uh, $714,285.71.4. I don't know what to do with the point four. You can keep ours. We found the treasure. So let's go enjoy it together. Come on. It's got to be buried on one of those little islands. The sandbar. I see some willow trees. How do we know which one it is? There's supposed to be a marker. H marks the spot. Or maybe we'll find someone else already there, feeding us to it. Is that Proby? Guys, I found it! That's five million divided by eight. I'm not doing it in one math. 